The theatre of the Academy of Performing Arts in Tel Aviv has been doing a variety of theatre shows since its establishment about six years ago. The Academy is a three-year school of theatre and performance. It has been established by a group of academics and theatre practitioners. We have built our little theatre from scratch. Our students and actors are coming from all over Israel and from all backgrounds. And we do theatre in order to inspire change. We are currently rehearsing The Merchant of Venice, a production which marks 400 years since the death of Shakespeare and 500 years since the establishment of the ghetto of Venice, which was the first ghetto in the world. Kylo, portrayed in our production by Palestinian actor Murad Hassan, his daughter Jessica and Tubal, his partner, open our production as refugees seeking shelter in the commercial Republic of Venice, a newly established nation state. Yet our busy Republic of Venice, whose Rialto looks very similar to a modern trading hall of a stock exchange, would not share its treasure of gold with foreigners. Either by the test of the casket, guiding Portia's suitors to the lead casket, or by direct interference in business, they would hinder any foreigner, such as the Prince of Morocco or the Prince of Aragon, the agent of the rival superpower, Spain, or of course the Jews, whose services they suddenly require. Tubal, and even Shylock's daughter Jessica, who elopes with her Christian lover, failed to assimilate into the Venetian society. And at the end of our production, all three of them don anew their wandering attire and go on as refugees to find their destiny elsewhere. A devoted team, designer Tali Itzhaki, composer Yuval Messner, choreographer Ran Bendror, and others have all come together to create a very fascinating production, engulf as the Shakespearean text is suggesting by music and dance. Yet our theater is not rich, it is unsubsidized. And in order to make this daring production materialize, we need your generous donation to make it happen. Thank you.